What's up everyone? It's another great day here at Rock Solid Motorsports. It is Thursday. So we're not on the weekend this time during the video. Just finished up this Fox body. I was just going to do a little walk around of it and tell you just a little bit about what we've done to it since I usually do that whenever I complete something. Uh, this one was brought to us by Tick Performance. You might have seen it in one of my last videos when we was uh, a little bit through the process but this has got the old drivetrain out of jonathan's uh trans am a crank drive blower rhs uh block i'm not going to give many details on it because it's a grudge car but they needed the piping done on it so we took care of the cold piping two big pro charger blow off valves uh we also cut the front bar it was going to be an issue getting the bail inlet on the front of the blower so we cut the bar and flanged it and made it removable so you get the bail inlet on there i don't think the customer is going to ever cut a hole in the front of his car they just wanted to make sure they could get that bail inlet on there the radiator they provided us this little looks like a little honda radiator or something the car is going to be on alcohol so it's not really going to be circulating it's just going to be you know something for the cylinder heads so uh, dry sump, this is also the system that was on Jonathan's car. I think they just put it over on this one. The fuel cell, this is our four gallon universal fuel cell that we sell. There's a lot of sales in that sense. But it also has the crash bar kit on it. You can add this as an option on the website. It comes with these weld bungs, it comes with the tabs, it also comes with hardware. It's already miter cut. You just have to weld it on both sides. I actually trimmed the leg length of this where it would go to this bar. And it's kind of at an angle because this bar dives down. But we took care of that. And I think that's about it on the front. Uh, this elbow setup, I'll talk a little bit about that. Some people have asked on the previous videos about the elbow. This is the Tick Performance Billet Elbow Setup or kit that they offer for the single plane intakes. They, I don't think they have it on their website yet, but it's going to be on there very soon because they're machining them right now. I actually purchased one for the OMG Boost car, my wife's car right here, and the future combo on it. But it's got the burst panel, it'll come with the flange, it'll come with the two halves as a weld kit to weld to the flange once you get it on your intake and stuff, and it'll come with the throttle body flange. So really nice piece, check it out, tickperformance.com. So let's look on the inside here. We uh, was going to get this cage inspected. We didn't do the roll cage in this car, but everything looked to be up to par. And I reached underneath there and felt the dash bar and it felt like it was inch and a quarter, but it turned out it was not. So we cut the original dash bar out and upgraded it to an inch and a quarter, which is SFI spec. So the cage inspector's coming back today to give that the seal of approval. So he'll get his NHRA sticker for 25.5. Also our vent tank trunk mounted vent tank see it's baffled in there uh i've done several videos on it before but this one we actually shrank down a little bit and i might offer this one as a fox body version since it is a little bit shorter and a little bit uh less deep front to back and uh, that's what we did for this car where the stack would come out where the original fuel cell used to be so it's a little piece of carbon he's got on a hinge here. I'm not going to open it because it won't open anymore, but I hole sawed the carbon where the stack would come right out the trunk there and he wouldn't have to cut any new holes. Might need to put some heat on that stuff to make it lay down a little bit. Not much support with that carbon piece there, but anyway, look for that on the website. I might since i did take a bunch of pictures of it i might add that as a separate item since it is a little bit smaller so 
that's a quick rundown of what we did to this fox body and uh we'll bring you more videos soon see you